Yo, what is good with y'all boys and girls, man? Now, as y'all see by the title of the video, I'm gonna be helping y'all with some tips and tricks on how to get good at the hood and improve your aim with sensitivities, macros, stuff like that. You know what I mean? Just to, you know, improve your gameplay and stuff like that whenever you're playing the hood. Now, if this video helped you, bro, if y'all enjoyed this video, bro, also don't forget to subscribe, bro. We're so, oh my God, I just messed up the word subscribe. What the hell? Don't forget to subscribe, bro. You know what I'm saying? We're so close to 18K. Our goal is to hit 20K, bro. If we get 20K, maybe I'll think about giving away a big giveaway in my Discord server. And I'm also looking to revive my Discord server. Check the description for it. And uh, without further ado, let's get into the video. So first things first, which I want to do is yeah, I want to focus on your tracing. All right. Now, right now, this is just like regular tracing. This won't really help you in the hood. But what you need to do is aim to the side what you want to do is aim to the side only because the hood is a ping based game and it's based off ping you know so you don't want to aim directly at the person whenever it comes to aiming in the hood or whatever especially with db only because um db has like a wide spread and you want to hit your character with the most damage as possible okay so look this is what happens whenever you aim to the side you hit them directly okay so that's what you want to do when it comes to aiming in the hood bro it's very simple you know like try to trace if you can't then you know try your best to aim to the side because aiming to the side is literally the best thing you can do because whenever you're tracing you want to hit your character look what happens when i try to aim directly at him you see how i miss that's exactly what you want to do whenever you're uh like in a battle or anything you want to directly aim to the side only because like i said the hood is ping base now if you <laughs> all right now if y'all want <laughs> bro he keep peeking bro stop peeking all right now if y'all need my like sensitivity or whatever to like really help you like i think my sensitivity is like pretty mid like it can be slow or fast but you can really edit your dpi and if you don't have dpi you can really edit like uh the sensitivity on roblox itself so my sensitivity is currently 0.059 and my dpi is 100 I mean a thousand my bad and uh i think it's pretty smooth for me depending uh like if you're long range i don't think this would be like very good i think slow sensitivity would be good but like for close range this is like one of the best sensitivities you could ever use on the hood in general only because of how decently fast and slow it is whenever you're like trying to trace your character it's like very easy smooth simple you know like it's not really too fast it's not too slow it's like right in the middle where you where it needs to be you feel me now a lot of y'all have really been asking for my macro like i said i did drop a macro and shaders tutorial but i will redo this macro tutorial again only because y'all keep asking all right so as you see i have a g305 right now and i have a blue yeti that doesn't really matter so look i have a g305 you know what i'm saying you can go to like target best buy they usually have it at target or best buy now what you want to do is they're they're also cheap and like 30 40 bucks you know what i'm saying you don't really lose that much money so what you want to do is you want to create a new macro right we're just going to name this macro poop okay now what i did i put it on toggle because i do not like holding like the side buttons whenever i'm macroing so i put it on toggle right and I also got this from Venn's Demise. I'm going to give you guys two macros. I'm going to give you guys Venn's and I'm going to give you guys mine. All right. Now, what you want to do is you want to go to system, mouse, right? And you want to go to scroll down. Okay. Now, you want to go to system, mouse. All right. You want to do the same thing, but scroll up this time. Okay. Now, you want to also add a delay. All right. Now, the first one is zero one. Okay. Now, we're going to delete this. The first one is zero one. All right. And then it's pretty simple and easy you know what i'm saying it's not really like too much and vens is usually 10 i'm pretty sure you can put it at 10 either one works they're both pretty good macros okay like they're very good very smooth very fast reliable and stuff like that so i mean it's pretty simple if you feel me so i'm gonna showcase the macro for y'all real quick only because like i know i know y'all are really like oh my god what does the macro look like this is the macro right now like it's pretty smooth there's really nothing wrong with the macro like i find it very smooth this is also on uh regular gfx by the way and we're gonna hop on low gfx real quick so we can uh show you guys the differences all right now as y'all already seen that's the macro on high gfx i'm gonna show you the macro on low gfx right now like it's not too fast it's not too you know what i'm saying not too slow it's very it's where it's supposed to be you know like it's a very chill macro 
personally i don't really macro bees that much with it unless i have to like like i said it's a very chill macro it's not really too much you can do with it personally i would i prefer this macro over my old macro that i used to use and uh yeah it's pretty simple and easy if this video helped you with your aim man like and subscribe you feel me it shows so much support man we're so close to 18k our goal is to hit 20k like i said i'm gonna drop a big giveaway in the discord server as soon as i hit 20k man it's gonna be crazy bro like seriously so don't forget to join the discord in the description you feel me stay in tune for giveaways and some future events i'm gonna try reviving my discord because i really haven't been paying attention to my discord and i also i'm looking for admin and staff for my discord server so join my discord server down below slap me a dm maybe or i'm gonna make a google doc staff application and uh also don't forget to join my clone the group with more so you know so i'll be dropping some fire clothes in there and uh, without further ado i'm in this video here i love y'all so much peace